Hello there, Dromir. Fat people are awesome. However, not because they are fat. This video is about fat shaming, as well as the opposite of it, namely acceptance of being fat. Now, some people may get offended by the word fat because it's not politically correct. I don't care if it's politically correct or not, it's simply a word and people should get offended by what it resembles rather than the word itself. Because if you start calling people that are overweight fluffy, then soon fluffy will become a negative word and we cannot use it without pissing people off. So stop getting pissed off by words and rather focus on the message itself. Now fat people do not annoy me or even offend me in whatever way. However, what does annoy me and what offends me is when people promote being fat as a good thing. Fat is not beautiful, fat is not a good thing. Being overweight and even being obese is a disease and it shouldn't be promoted. Now normally I'm against conformity and stuff like that and I don't want everyone to look the same as everyone else. However, when it comes to being overweight I think there is a more serious problem here. We should not accept a disease that is easily prevented and therefore I think fat shaming is better than fat promotion. Overweight is not a good thing. Being obese is bad and being morbidly obese is terrible. At what point in life do people think, ah, who cares, let's gain 500 pounds and become completely disabled. Disability is not something you normally choose for, however, if you are morbidly obese, you kind of choose to become disabled. And yes, some people can eat more without gaining much weight, whereas others struggle to keep weight up. And there are even genetic disabilities that can make you more fat, such as Prader-Willi syndrome, which is actually rare. And there are also some medications that can make you gain weight. However, in the end, it's all about calories. Don't blame the companies or even the government for being fat. Nobody forces you to eat an overload of calories. It's not GMOs or food additives or sweeteners, artificial sweeteners that make you fat. No. It's the hand filled with food that can't stop moving towards your mouth that's making you fat. Now, this may sound rough, however, you have to realize what the problem is before you can start solving it. Do not ever take pride in being fat and also don't encourage people to become or to stay fat. However, do encourage fat people though. Encourage them to lose some weight and to become an he a healthier and perhaps even better version of themselves. So if you see someone at the gym that is overweight and wants to lose weight, encourage them to lose weight rather than mock them and bully them. Don't bully fat people. Don't do that ever. Because being fat is not an entirely personal problem. It is a problem for the entire society. We have to pay more for health care, much like people who smoke. On the other hand, don't accept when someone says, oh, it's okay if you're fat and especially don't say it yourself to someone who is overweight that it is all right that they are overweight. Rather focus on their positive points such as being funny or being smart, being good at something in particular, but don't focus on saying that it is okay to be fat. Fat acceptance is one of the worst things in modern day society and we shouldn't tolerate it. Now I think there are going to be some people that say, well, why don't you enjoy life? Why don't you ever treat your body on something nice such as some hamburgers or chocolate? And well, if you have watched this video, you probably already know where you can put that advice and it's not in your mouth. Your body doesn't need all this unhealthy food and it's definitely not treating your body right if you put hamburgers and stuff like that into it. Rather treat your body on fruits and vegetables and perhaps you can even poop every once in a while which is also considered a treat for your body even though your nose and the nose of others don't like it. I also dislike it when people say everything in moderation. So killing just a few people is not bad. However, if you kill a hundred then it is wrong. Seriously, where is the logic in that idiotic sentence? Stop using this as an excuse to eat crappy food all day. And for those who are watching this video and are overweight themselves, please note that I have nothing against you personally. Yes, you are definitely more than just a number on the scale. However, this should refer to your personality, your skill set, your achievements, and so on. Basically, who you are as a person. But it should not refer to the useless amount of body tissue, namely fat, that you carry along. Find some help. 
educate yourself and above all learn to love yourself despite being fat before you make the next movement which is losing weight that's it for this video thank you for watching subscribe for more thumbs up and let me know if you agree i will see you next time